Lieutenant Governor Kay Ivey visited Etowah County this afternoon to survey the storm damage in the Smith Institute community. The Lieutenant Governor came on behalf of Governor Robert Bentley, whose plane was grounded this afternoon due to weather concerns. Ivey spent the afternoon visiting with storm survivors in the FEMA Aid Center that is set up at Bethlehem Baptist Church. She also toured the storm ravaged community and stopped to visit with a few affected families. The Lieutenant Governor says that seeing communities come together in the face of such adversity makes her proud to be from Alabama. Well, it's always amazing to me and so wonderful. Makes you so proud to be an Alabamian is to see the not only first line responders and the the help groups, whether it's Red Cross or anybody else like that, but it's family, friends and neighbors just not knowing one another and reaching out and saying, here's my chainsaw, where you want to cut? And going to work. So that's what's so impressive about our people pulling together. The Feimster family is one of the families that Ivy spoke with today and heard an amazing story of how they survived despite their home being completely destroyed and not just destroyed, completely lifted from its foundation, spun around 180 degrees and moved more than 200 feet from its original location. If I heard the storm coming, I knew, I said, this is something I've never heard before. So anyway, we got our kids up. By the time we got them awake uh, and, and got in the hallway, the windows started shattering out of the house. And we, we just wadded up in a wad and, and held on to each other and rode it out. And, you know, windows shattering, dirt flying, and it, it was rough. Roof came off. Now that the federal disaster declaration has been approved, FEMA is on site in the community. Assistance is also available online at disasterassistance.gov or by calling 800-621-3362. You can also apply via your mobile device at m.fema.gov.